tell us, uh, go ahead and sum up your team's performance overall. Well, it's a fantastic reaction. It's never easy to, to bounce back after a loss in double overtime, uh, but we had to focus on the positives, and I thought the other night we did a lot of great things. So we needed to make sure we started with that intensity today. And I thought we did, I thought we got a lot of good looks at goal. Uh, and if you keep making the runs, we got the finishes and I think we deserved the lead at half time. You had a, a lot of great individual performances, but it looked like the team worked a lot better today. Yeah, well we're retaining the ball a lot better and uh, we're learning our roles and responsibilities of the system uh, better because we're now a year on from when we've implemented it. So. The ladies are starting to, uh, to make sure that they, they cover their jobs and responsibilities and I think you've seen it, it's the strength of the depth came in, even the, the ladies that came in off the bench offered the same uh, performance. Uh, and we've got to say something about Katie, it's a school record, most individual goals in a, in a game. Well, it's, it's nice to have uh, a record that Nikki Gears doesn't hold, you right. know, so our best pal holds it now, you know, but I think she just said she equaled our, our goals for the season. but. Yeah, it's fantastic strikes, uh, just instinct, you know. Uh, I know she was a little bit disappointed with the result the other night, so that will give her confidence going into the weekend, you know. But I thought, as a whole, that all the experienced players really stepped up today and, and uh, helped bed in the freshmen, you know.